fellas, let's give it up for our next single woman. Can you please introduce yourself, name, age, occupation? I'm Malaysia, I'm 29, and I am a bartender and a model. Okay, <laughs> all right. So, uh, Malaysia, what is your, your type? Um, nice dress, um, polite, generous. Okay, and um, I'll also know, I would like to also know, what are your deal breakers, non-negotiables? Um, cheap, okay. not polite, um, body odor, stink, you know, stuff like that. Okay, all right, that's good. All right, all the menus seem to still be on. Damn! Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, welcome to the channel. This woman is super tall. And you guys heard one of her deal breakers is being cheap. You guys know what that means, right? She probably the type of women who love to spend money. And there's some other stuff she's in, body order and all this stuff. You got to take care of yourself. Okay. So we got two balloons that pop. Let's go ahead and figure out why they pop the balloon. All right. Okay. okay. Let's move forward. Okay. All right. So we can start from here. All right. Can you introduce yourself, name, age, occupation, and why you pop the balloon? Name is Teddy, 34, um, work in cybersecurity. She's gorgeous. She's just way too tall for me. And I can't, I'm not sure if I can carry you. No, you do look good, but that's way too tall. It's a deal breaker. Wait, you said you're not sure if you can carry her? Yeah, because she's, she's tall. Okay. All right. I think you can carry her. You're, you're uh, I don't deadlift. I, I, I bench, but I'm not sure if I'll be able to carry her. Okay. okay. How do you feel about that? Um, He's not confident with that in himself. So, mm. I mean, he seems... Uh, yeah. Is he your type? No. Oh. No. Um, I do love his skin color. I just don't like the way he's dressed. Um, he's look kind of older. So, um, I don't know. I like a cute face. You know? you like a cute face? Mm -hmm. What do you mean by a cute face? What do you mean by that? So now, why why does she keep pulling her dress down? You know, you come in in a dating show. At least put something longer where you wouldn't have to to pull keep pulling your dress like this is crazy. Do you guys think those heels that she has? Do you think those are comfortable? Because this woman is way too tall, and then now she have heels on. I'm just curious. Do what do you guys think? What do you mean by cute face? Like Teddy has beautiful teeth, but um, his face was giving. He's been through a lot. Damn. He's very uh, older, wiser man. Like, you know, he, he's been through a lot of years in his life. I mean, I was definitely very disappointed. I consider myself medium ugly. Here I come. So I think I do pass the test when it comes to the scale of, you know, rating. So, you know, it, it is what it is. You know, I think because she's, she's too tall, I think maybe she took that very personal. But I, I think, she, of course, she's beautiful, but I, I consider myself medium ugly. He's not cute. I did not know there was a, there was a, such a thing, medium ugly. Is it that you ugly or you cute? No, I'm not to me. Sorry. Well, I mean, she's gorgeous. She's just too Nice tall. teeth. I love Thank your you. teeth. Thank you. Amazing. I do love your nose piercings. Thank I think. you. Again, Thank I love you. your tattoos. You are gorgeous. You. Like, I love your energy, your passion. Just to hide me. Yeah. Know? Yeah. A lot of guys is insecure, so. Oh, oh really? Thank you. All right. I mean, um, also, I would like to know, do you, would you mind being a guy that's shorter than you? There's no problem for me. Okay. This is not being insecure, right? This, those, if he said you are too tall, what's wrong with that? A lot of, a lot of women don't want to date a man shorter than them. So does that mean they're insecure about themselves? This is nonsense. He don't want to date you because of your height. Just accept it and move on. This balloon as well. All right. Um, name, age, occupation, and white pops balloon. I'm more 27. I pop because I'm just not attracted to you. Yeah. You look really pretty, though. Uh, I just didn't find her attractive. She's pretty, but just not for me. Like, I like everything about her, like the height, the tattoos, everything looks good. It's just not my type. Thank but, you. I mean, I'm just not attracted. That's about it. 
Um, okay. All right. Um, you have any remarks? What do you think about him? Is he your type? You like him? I don't know if he's attracted to women. Damn. I mean, the way he looks, oh, I wouldn't think. That. He needs some milk. <laughs> Wait, why, why don't you think that he's attracted to women? He's giving me flamboyant in the way his he present himself. So, um, I'm sorry, no disrespect, nah, but I get, uh, I get it a lot. It's whatever. Um, people think I'm gay for whatever reason. I don't know. I take it as a compliment. What do you mean by that? Uh, when I think of gay people, when I see them, they look like they take care of themselves. So, and some people don't. So when I hear that, it's kind of like a compliment. So it doesn't really bother me. Well, it's just all the jewelries and pearls, the hair color, he's into hair dye. I mean, it's giving soft boy era. It wasn't my speed. I love a man, man. Like, I like somebody that's, you know? Yeah. That's not ridiculous to say that. And he's light skinned, so. Um, you get it when a lot. I look at people like you, that's what I see. Oh, so like a lot of people think that you're homosexual? Yeah, um, my, <laughs> yeah uh, my thing is I like pearls, so I wear it a lot and I can probably like give off a different vibe. So, I mean, but I mean, it's, it is what it is. Okay. All right, but can you clarify that? You're no, you're I'm, I'm not. Yeah, I'm straight. I'm not. Okay. okay. All right, yeah, it's, it's good to clarify that. We want to make sure, you know, okay? Sensational. Yeah. All right. Okay. Um, okay, that's unfortunate that, you know, it wasn't pairing, but we'll she go back. Good. You said what? Good. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. All right, let's move back and figure out okay. if these two other balloons could possibly be a match. All right? So now, this is a time for you to further get to know the guys. They already know a few things about you. So um, can you please give us a question? Um, and then we'll get an answer. Any one of them? No, so you're gonna get a you're gonna give us a question, and based on their answers, you're gonna get, get, go ahead and eliminate one of these people, right? Do y'all mind dating a taller girl? <laughs> it's not the first time I dated a tall girl. It's no problem with me whatsoever. We ain't got to worry about that. All right. Let's move to heaven. Hello, my name is Kenny, and I love it. You love it? Yeah, you love being sure. a taller woman? Yeah, for sure. Okay. Okay. All right. I love it. Okay, right, let's come back. Let's come back. This woman can pick most of them. I think she can pick all of them up. Look how big she is. She is big and tall. I'm not saying there's something wrong with that, but I think she can pick all those men up. Okay. All right. So, I mean, what do you think about their answers? I mean, it was cute and like it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um, do you, do you have another question? Um, do you have any children? Zero. Okay. Okay. Zero. Okay. Zero. Okay. All right. I, I mean, they're they're all passing. We need a we need a harder question here, right? You land them off the hook too quick. Okay. So, so any, any other question? I'm a bartender. Okay. I stay on my feet long nights. Uh huh. I like to get rubbed down for hours. Mm. Do you mind doing that for me? My ankles get swollen. Oh. I, 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 my back hurt. I'm a big girl. Do you mind rubbing me down for hours without having an attitude or being upset? <laughs> I see what's going on. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. No. So, so why'd you pop your balloon and, you know, you have something against rubbing a woman down? First of all, let me make this clear. I would love to rub me down all the time, mm -hmm. but it's not the place for that. Um, the star tender, you know, the bartender, star tender thing, been there, done that. I just, again, it's setting up phase of my life. You know, your career choice, your career choice, ain't nothing wrong with that. I think you're gorgeous. I love the height. I love all, all. It just ain't for me, honestly, right now. Um, he looked like my customers who come at my bars, so I'm kind of confused. And I said it in the beginning that I was a bartender, and he let it slide. But then when I asked about the rubbing, he popped the balloon at the rubbing, like me getting rubbed down when I said that I work long hours. So I was kind of confused once again, light skin, flamboyant. So it was kind of like confusing and down. It's not for you. No, nah, no, nah, I just, when you said the start to the thing and I let you finish your thing, I didn't want to be rude to pop you mid sentence. I wanted to wait till you finish. That's all. I didn't want to be rude to interrupt you mid sentence. Mm -hmm. That's all. Okay. Yeah. okay. All right. Okay, let's go down. I don't know if you guys notice that, right? 
every time she got rejected she's finding something wrong with the person so she can get back at them this is just, this is just crazy if somebody don't like you they don't like you just move on find somebody that like you for who you are and it is another thing i don't think you should have a problem if your girl working for long hours i don't see what's wrong with that there's nothing wrong with that if she had a long day she wants you to massage her body this shouldn't be a problem i have one can you go ahead and also answer her question we're rubbing rubbing her down okay so i'm kenny and yeah i mean so when it comes to giving her massages and whatever she wants i mean i, I would uh I appreciate doing that. This is what I like to do myself. Okay. But when it comes to the occupation, the career, the job, I don't really like that because I've been like, you know, in type of girls. I could take them as friends, but like not like a serious relationship. For sure. How do you feel about that? Um, would you like your man to make sure to love your occupation? And he don't have to love it. He has to know that I'm just, I went to school for mixology. So, oh. so I'm, I'm going to ask uh, what actually do you do? You said bartender, like, what's the, like, you know, bartender, they like different varieties. Bartenders depend on the type, the color. Okay, so what, what's what the type, you know? what, what is the type that you know of? Well, I mean, I, I'm not saying all type, but different types. <laughs> okay. Okay, so he's asking, what type of bartender are you? Um, so I currently run a bar in Brooklyn. It's called Jigger Jerk Spot. I am the bar manager and I have bartenders. Oh, okay, okay. So it's a part of a restaurant mm -hmm. and I am promoting it crazy, going to radio stations. And also I, I do once in a blue work in the strip clubs and sweet and bartender and different things like that. But yeah, and I do big parties as well. Okay. All right. How you feel about that? So good. Okay. All right. So can we? Can you come back? Can you come back here? All right. Can y'all two lovebirds come back here? Let's figure out if this could be a match. All right. It's a, a possible match that we have here. Uh, we'll give you an opportunity, right, to ask her a question. Do you have any questions for her? Last minute questions. That's it. So I want to ask you, uh, what's your? Are you God fearing? Like, oh yeah, I was raised in a church. Okay, and uh, I was gonna ask if you're family oriented. Um, yes, um, I, I have, well, if you know, Christian family is judgmental. They don't appreciate, you know, me being a bartender, but, um, they accept it. And I do talk to my mom and dad every day. Um, my siblings is far away. I don't really get to talk to them. They're married. They got their own stuff going on. So I'm the baby. So, but when I do need to clock in with the family, is there right there phone call the way okay all right I, it seems like you love you love everything that you're yeah, hearing right sure. okay do you have any questions for you um i want to know your sign uh my sign i'm a tourist tourist yeah okay okay all right um, what, what, what do you like about Taurus? it seems like you like Taurus. i mean i'm an aries so we're like right there okay all right, you have you have the last better question. Yeah, I was gonna ask age. I didn't age. hear her age the last time. Um, so. I said I was twenty nine. Twenty nine. Right, cool. Yeah. Okay. How old are you? I'm twenty five. Could you do you mind giving a man you know that is interested in you a chance, although he's younger than you? Um, it depends on what he has to bring. Do you have your own car? Do you have your own apartment? Yes. Okay. Okay. All right. So, is this a match? Is this a match? Yeah, one more question. Okay. <laughs> what's, what's, the, what's the question here? I forgot. I'm cool. Okay. All right. So, this is a match. Yeah. All right. So, we have our second match. Yeah. <laughs> All right. You can go ahead and take your queen away. <laughs> This woman about to pick him up. As soon as they get to the door, she's just gonna pick him up. Just like a baby.